Hi, this is Monse. If you've been to Tom's blog today, you notice this terrific graphic of a person popping out of a laptop. Let's create this same effect in PowerPoint. I have my slide set up with an image of a man and an image of a laptop. Let's center the image over the laptop. Okay. And what we're going to do next is create a shape over the laptop screen and the man's arm. Let's do that by clicking Insert Shapes and grabbing the Freeform tool. I'm going to start with the left hand of the, of, the, of the screen. Just click around it. Now I can't really see where my third point should go, but it doesn't really matter because I can modify that later. And I'm going to continue clicking around the screen and then start by making a selection around the, man, the man's arm. I'm not going to be too precise here because he was on a transparent background, so accuracy does not matter here. And I'm going to close off this shape where I started. Okay, very good. Now, you'll notice that the shape was filled with a color. Sometimes this will happen, and sometimes you'll just see an outline. Either way, you're doing it right, so just proceed. Now, let's get rid of the picture of the man. So make sure you select him, hit delete, and what we can do now is modify our shape. So select your, select your shape, right click, and then click Edit Points. And what we're going to do is we're going to drag out this shape so that it better fills the screen. OK, that looks good. Now we are going to fill the shape with the image of the man. So it's selected. Let's right click, choose Format Shape make sure that your fill option is selected then check picture or texture fill and let's navigate to our picture so insert file from okay here it is click insert very good now it looks kind of funny and we can correct that by simply checking the tile picture as texture box if you need to move the man, you can always use the offset X and the offset Y coordinates just by checking these arrows. He looks good where he is, so I'm not going to bother with that. I'm going to close out of that. Now, we still have this outline around our shape. Let's get rid of that. Double click on it, on your shape, and then click Shape Outline, and then select No Outline. Okay, very good. It looks like we created this effect in PowerPoint and looks pretty good to me. Thank you.